readers, I want to share a new book recommendation for you today. And this is a Newbery Award winner from 2008. And it's one of the few Newberries that has pictures. Um, you can see that the front cover is really beautifully illustrated, but don't be deceived, this is not a picture book for little kids. I would say that probably the older that you are in the six to 13 range, the more you'll appreciate the humor and the personality in this book but it really is for everyone. So let me tell you, this is um, called Good Masters, Sweet Ladies, and this is a little education about medieval times. However, it's not just a straight textbook. In fact, it's a collection of monologues, some poems and some um, just thoughts for 17 different young people who live in a medieval village. So for example, Hugo, the Lord's nephew, has this little um, monologue and he tells us about what it's like to be him and the nephew of the Lord and so you're hearing each person's perspective on a medieval village and um, there are also a couple of informational pages where you learn a little bit more about customs and times for example this one is about falconry or training birds to hunt and so there's a little description of how that goes um, and you can learn a little bit more also on each page there are some great little footnotes to tell you more about what words mean or um, where something comes from or whether it's a true story. This is a terrific book. You can sit down and read it in one day or you can break it up and read a little poem here and a little poem there over the course of a few weeks. I got this at my local library in the Newberry section and I'll be returning it soon so the next person can borrow it. Um, but I have to recommend this one. Um, the second book I wanna recommend is Begins on a Dark and Stormy Night, A Wrinkle in Time by Madeline Langle. This is a terrific one. Today I read it for the fifth time. I do love this story. Um, it's epic and it has good and evil, light and dark, love and hate, and it's about people who feel like they don't fit in or don't have enough to offer the world, and they, of course, find out that they do. So I can't recommend this one enough, especially on a stormy day like today. It was a great book to reread. So I want to hear how your reading is going. Don't forget to tag us at hashtag read a newberry, um, or you can be part of our private Facebook group or send me a message. I hope that your reading is going great and I will check in with you soon.